So guys, uh, I finished one, so that's uh, the Aber barrels, machine gun, uh, they look good, they look good, <coughs> uh, do, do, do they look better? Than the plastic ones. Uh, oh. I don't know. 
I think I was busy for one around one hour and uh, like I said I think for the other ones I will remove that end part here and place the Aber one but change hold the barrel I don't know uh, also a problem I saw on the instructions you have to uh, cut a piece of rod 5.8 mil uh, but if you measure oh, one it's 4.8 mil so there you must be careful that you may make it not too long uh, it's a hole from one mil uh, if you measure the rod you have I think I also explain it in the unboxing if you cut the rod six pieces of 5.8 mil you just have enough uh, so I searched something that was one mil uh, I have some plastic rods that I can use you need to clean the hole sometimes a bit and even then you see it's hard to go in uh, <coughs> so I didn't use that but I found I had some paper clips that also was one mil and that was a bit easier to put it in so guys uh, that is the machine gun uh, I also did the main gun uh, is it worth uh, not for me if you could buy those pieces separately the end nozzles of the machine guns that I should buy and put them otherwise no uh, like also Knight said and has fed the only down side of the barrel that you have an eject pin mark at the top so but otherwise uh, it's a lot of work for not something that adds a lot of more oomph to it the original barrel is drilled out 
nicely uh, so yeah uh, it's worth uh, <coughs> for me it's a good I uh, it was something I bought it all together uh, also didn't know it was at first in so I was happy it was but uh, I don't think the other machine guns uh, I will change the barrel I only will change the end nozzles cut them out uh, drill a little hole some CA glue and I will put them in so guys that was that part uh, it will be a strange uh, part and told to with your bits and do this but I hope it will all come together uh, so I will s let you see what I'm up to next so one moment guys So, that says what I am at the moment, uh, not so far as Nige, uh, also for me uh, I will, was ill for a week, uh, <coughs> my knee operation was uh, I had my knee operation in December, so January I'm back at work. So less time to do stuff, work, kids, and it's a bit chilly in my basement, but that's uh, a problem of mine. Uh, painting wise, like you see, I did nothing and why is it <coughs> um, you don't find no I will start first uh, and Nige uh, was asking those were radiator brackets uh, and the instructions you need to paint them green so he was questioning it about are they really green were they really green and that's uh, I, I began to think about it uh, did a little bit of research and you don't find almost no pictures of the inside outside no problem uh, inside uh, you don't find them uh, or they are very rare uh, it's normal there was only one tank that uh, was saved that's in a museum in, uh, in Australia <coughs> uh, but there's also a copy in a tank museum in Germany uh, I will put the links in the descriptions and there's also a little vid um, 
and explanation of that tank, so the A7V that in, is in that museum and that tank is 90% accurate 90-95% accurate uh, so I mailed uh, the museum if they have some pictures about paint and some pictures inside uh, they don't have them they refer to a book but that book uh, you don't find it new I, they don't make it anymore you can find that book but it's very 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 expensive and now I'm also not a super freak that says well oh, I will buy it because I have to know that detail or that detail uh, I did some further research and I found that book uh, it costed me only 6 euros mm, didn't need to pay any shipment because it was shipped to the it will be shipped to the bookstore and there I'm waiting for that book so I hope in that book I have, will have some more information about paint etc what I did was the two weight wages put all the little scribblies on it at front back um, also Knight uh, told that in his vid and I'm the same principle uh, you can glue before painting uh, that photo edge grill on that will look very nice but you have a chance to see the beige clear uh, underneath so I will also first paint it of give some black paint put the grill on and then prime or paint all everything uh, also put the big uh, munition box from the gun together uh, also don't know if I will close it or make it open if I do it make it open I will need to remove I fill up those two ejector pen marks uh, I also glue together those uh, seeds munition case wax together so that are the seeds for the machine gun man and inside you can put munition box for the machine gun so you have four high ones and two low ones and there were all right the first is water fiddly so you have uh, one, two, three, four, five pieces. Uh, <coughs> what I did, I found out what uh, was the best way to work. I put that piece flat on my bench put some glue put one piece straight second third piece straight 
watched the world straight and waited uh, a minute or two, three, uh, that the glue begins to melt the plastic a bit. Then put it some glue on the top and then put it that piece on. Then you can take it between your fingers and move it a bit in good position. And uh, that works worked fine for me. I said the first one was fiddly. You need to search a bit how it works for you and if you found a way it will be I it will work. It will work, sir. Uh, something I also want to do. I'm not sure here. I'm thinking about it. It's if you put that piece on here. And uh, I want to be able to remove the top of the tank that you see the interior. Uh, the problem is you will be able to look there inside. Uh, I contacted Ming. Uh, of there is possible of there is a kit somewhere that make uh, the engines uh, I, I send it uh, on the website uh, you can send a message from messenger to Ming I didn't had an answer. I didn't even know if they saw it. Uh, I will look if there is possible. I think it will to send them an email and ask them. I just found out that in the time you can you can buy bought that kit with two engine, but it was limited edition. So bad a shame we don't have the engine. Uh, if I can't find the engine, I'm thinking to make two uh, panels, both sides, uh, to close that gap. Uh, maybe one side some uh, openings uh, something like uh, uh, sorry oh yeah something like one moment like uh, sorry about plastic like you have on the top that there can be air when the where the engine is and at the other side, maybe something making with the door. Uh, but that I'm not sure yet. I also will see that when I have that booklet. And I hope I will have some more information in it. Uh, so guys, that was that part for me. Uh, go watch Nige. Uh, his wit he will be for I uh, again on me but that's normal I have no problem with it the only problem I have is not to go watch his vid before I made it uh, Will it be possible? I don't think, but 
I will do my best. So guys, that was it for me now. Uh, so I hope next week I have the second part. Um, I, the next part online. So guys, see you. Bye.